Hey guys, it's Eric here at Talbot City. Check it out. I found a radio station for sale. This is WTAB, 1370 AM. They play Southern Gospel. On Sundays they play some church. And uh, it's a really nice little setup here. WTAB, 1370. Right on the side of, oh, I think it's US 9, maybe. But a nice little building. It's for sale. Got some land around it, obviously. Looks like there's a big uh, company back here, Atlantic Corporation, con I don't know, convec Convected Products? I'm not sure, I can't read that sign very well. <laughs> My sunglasses. But yeah, there's the tower. It's guided pretty well. Hard to say how tall it is, but it looks like it's up there. And it's strong. I was listening to this uh, all the way down in Myrtle Beach. And apparently looked up uh, look up to see the, you know, for sale. I tried to get in touch with the realtor. They ignored my calls and my email. So whoever the realtor is for these people, they should fire them. And probably sue them because they might have had a sale here. But... Uh, yeah, you can hear it all the way up in Wilmington, too. It's 5,000 watts, and it's been on the air. It's, a, it's what they call a heritage station. It's been on the air for a very, very long time. Now, it does not have a generator, so if it goes offline, you know, due to power outage, it's, it's done for. But, yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool setup. Not a very long video here, as I can't go inside because the realtor refused to answer his phone calls, but that's fine. We're down here on Family Matters. I wish it was a vacation, but it wasn't. But we're down here for Family Matters, and I figured I'd stop and check it out. I'm always looking to buy a radio station. I've been looking since I was 14. I probably will be looking when I'm 59 million years old. I was going to say when I'm 50, but, well, we passed that mark, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, nice building. It looks like they have enough room for studios in there. According to the uh, internet, which never lies, the website that has this for sale says that it's uh, with land and, and site and everything else, and that it does have studios inside of it, and that back in the day it was quite the station. I think you could bring this thing and make it a uh, <coughs> well, top five in the market, probably. It's quite a signal. Like I said, you could reach all the way between two major tourist destinations and a whole lot of land in between, you could do a lot with that. And it, and it might have been a, a good choice, but unfortunately, that's as much as I can show you. So what do you think, man? You ever want to own a radio station? You ever want to be a part of radio history? Let me know in the comments. I'm kind of curious if this is a dream that is just mine or if other people share it. Till next time, my friends, take care.